All right, you ready? Never been more ready. Never been more ready. <laughs> He's so excited to do this video. He wants to do another video, and I want something more upbeat. We need to like... Distract ourselves from everything that's going yeah. on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah. What are we doing? So we're doing a... I don't want to do a stupid pandemic update, and I... I just think that sometimes, I don't want to ignore it, our daily videos are not ignoring it by any means, but I just think we need a little something, a little pick-me-up. And so we're going to do... This is a little pick-me-up going out to all our great little viewers. Yeah. We appreciate it. And this is actually from one of our viewers, Laura. She posted this on her Facebook page the other day, and I, I asked her if this is something that Jason and I should do, and she said, yeah, okay. I don't know why I'm not Sorry. <laughs> Okay, all right, so we're gonna, I'm gonna ask the questions, and it's just a really quick, we've got 50 questions, we'll get through as many of them as we can, but they're just, it, they're just pointless questions. 50 things you've never been asked. Some of them are dumb, and some of them are not. Let's, let's see what they are, what are Okay, they? number one, what is the color of your hairbrush? Or, they're black and blue, and he doesn't have a brush. I don't have one. Name a food you've never, you never eat. I don't know, I never eat it, so I don't think about it. What do you mean? Broccoli. You don't eat broccoli. Okay, I don't like broccoli. I do not eat anchovies. Yeah, anchovies. Okay. I don't eat anchovies. Are you typically too warm or too cold? I'm always You're too warm. You're always warm. I'm, I'm not fine. You're normal. No. Um, what are you? What were you doing 45 minutes ago? I was making little things for my brother. And I was editing the video that was up the day before this one. What is your favorite candy bar? Twix. And mine is probably Reese's peanut butter cups. Have you ever been to a professional sports team? Sports event. Whatever. Same thing. <laughs> I'm trying to read these quickly. No, she hasn't. Yes, yes, I have. I've been to Mariners games. Oh, okay. oh yeah, we did go. We've never stayed to a I've been to jazz night. game. Been to... I've been to a bunch of baseball games. Stadiums all over the country. I don't even care oh, about baseball. Oh, he's fancy like that. I don't that. even care about baseball. No. It's just the way it goes. What is your favorite ice cream? The one I'm liking lately, and you'd know about oh, it from other videos, yeah. is the... Uh, Pineapple sherbet sherbet from uh, I think it might even be the Safeway brand. Mm hmm It's really good. It's really good. I like anything chocolate, but if I was gonna add something to it, it's like moose tracks, chocolate moose tracks. Those are good. Or just chocolate peanut butter. Anything with chocolate and peanut butter in it is like my ultimate my ice cream. And you guys can leave your comments in below and what your answers are to these things. Yeah, okay. if you want to answer them yourself, you're totally welcome to. What was the last thing you had to drink? Milk. Water. He would have thought that I said Coke, but I have not had my Coke today. And it is 3 p.m. I'm doing really good. Part of the reason why I want to get through this video is because I really want a Coke. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like your wallet? I think they're questions you've yeah, never been asked. Those are the really stupid ones. That one's stupid. Next one. No, they're questions. You know, I don't like your wallet. I, that's, it's my wallet. So I like the functionality of my wallet, but I don't like the look of it. What is the last thing you ate? Peanut butter jelly sandwich. I just ate a cheese stick. Did you buy any new clothes last weekend? Any what? New clothes. I haven't bought new clothes in forever. <laughs> weekend? Crap, who buys clothes every weekend? All right, next one. No, I have not bought anything. The last sporting event you watched? It was probably the last Super Seahawks Bowl? game. No, the Super Bowl. Did yeah, we watched watch? the Super Bowl. Yeah, we did. Okay, yeah, yeah we watched we the did Super watch. Bowl. Uh, what is your favorite flavor of popcorn? Um, I'm in agreement with Laura Butter, lots of it. Yeah, of course. Like, yeah. Who is the last person you sent a text message to? It was probably to you. I came down this morning and I thought you were staying home from work today and he was gone. Uh, it was actually to Kaylee. Oh, okay. Our daughter, in case you're new. <laughs> she's kind of non-existent in these videos. She doesn't like to be on camera, which is totally fine. Yeah. She's a teenager. She's almost 15. So if you have an almost 15 year old, you'll understand. Do we ever do you ever go camping? We would love to do more, but yeah. we don't really very often. But we do go. You can't say we don't go. If you go, oh, we didn't go last summer, but we've gone every summer before that. Not every summer before that, but we do go. Okay, he's whatever. Move on. We neither one of us have a tan. That's do you, <laughs> we are white. Do you take vitamins? Yes. Oh, I skipped over one. If if you live in a really rainy place. Uh, overcast vitamin you, D really works. I'm not a pill pusher, but man mm -hmm. vitamin D really works It's helped me this this year. He's a different person. We would not yeah. survive our marriage During this pandemic if he wasn't taking his vitamin yeah. D. I'm not even kidding. He's a different person <laughs> this year 
He's taking if two. If I could get out and do more hikes and be outdoors more, then I wouldn't have to take it, but I can't. But trails are off limits unless they're really no, like. I can do it. They're, they're the ones you do are okay. Yeah. Whatever. Do you prefer Chinese food over pizza? No. I that's tough. No. No. Pizza. T I, pizza a more yeah I'll probably crave pizza more often but Chinese food is good but uh, what I, about um, oh now I'm craving that um, Mongolian beef that was pretty good the last maybe time we should see if they have takeout that pad thai and that Mongolian beef okay well Ooh, uh, that sounds so good tonight take your coke and then we'll be fine <laughs> do you drink your soda with the straw who does that I do depends on what kind of like no you don't what form of coke yeah because it, if it's fountain coke yeah it has to be a straw everything from the fountain but i love but some people like to take a can of coke and pour it into a glass with ice and have it with a straw and i don't i like it straight out of the can okay. depends. It depends don't Late. kill the seals stop <laughs> using straws i use reusable straws okay i do not buy straws anymore uh, what color socks do you usually wear? To work, usually black. Uh, to kick around, I have these cool orange socks. They're they're neon. They're they're crazy color, but they they're really comfortable. I wear whatever he brings home from the store. Um, do you ever drive above the speed limit? Yeah, most of the time. Most of the time, <laughs> just barely above. What terrifies you? <laughs> the pandemic situation. Yeah, yeah. Not, losing our business. Not going back to work and losing our business. Yeah, yeah. right now it's losing our business. Yeah. Another worry of mine is breast cancer. Um, that's like one of my, hang on one second. What, Chelsea? She get tested. Oh, she's just watching us. Yeah, breast cancer is one of my top, like I have a feeling at some point in my life I will have it. Um, you should get tested though. Look to your left, what do you see? We see our outside that we can't go to. <laughs> we can go outside. We can go outside, but they're trying to tell us to be inside as much as we can. What chore do you hate the most? I hate having to clean the bathroom because Dana never does it. Because I hate cleaning the bathroom. You never so do it. Not, I know. I, I cleaned it so many times. I did the counters last. <laughs> <laughs> no, you didn't. Abby okay, didn't. No, we're not up for discussion. No. What, what you, chore no, can no, I get out of? Because no. I don't like it. <laughs> Everything else. What do you think of Dude, no way. That's not when true. you hear an Australian accent? Cool. Laura, shame on you. It's not nails on a chalkboard. <laughs> I literally have my Surrey on my phone with an Australian accent or a British accent. This is I, British. I tried to make mine an Australian woman's voice. It's, I guess you'd say it's an older voice than I was kind of expecting. But. <laughs> he wants a young version. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of cool to have an Australian voice. Whatever. All right, all right. Favorite soda? It's obvious for me. Coke is my favorite. I, I guess it has to be root beer. I'm trying to avoid sodas now, but yeah, he doesn't. We don't buy soda for him. Save money. Do you go in a fast food place or just go through the drive-through? Most of the time, we drive-through. Yeah, drive-through. Uh, if the I kids are with me, they want me to go inside, but I don't. They're young enough, or they're old enough now that I don't have to. Who is the last person you talked to? Besides you? Yeah, I mean we're just at home, so we're only talking Ashley, to each other. Yeah, just yeah. Favorite cut of beef? I don't know enough about beef. Steak. Okay. A New York That's not a cut. I know, but like, <laughs> New York steak, this is a cut? That's a cut of meat? No. What kind of? No, there are certain steaks. I know, but like. Different what? cuts. Steak, steak in of itself is not a, a cut. A cut of meat? No, it's not. It's like saying beef, little round one. Right, okay, so what was the one I ordered last time? Top sirloin. Okay, what was the one I ordered then? Rib cut. Okay, he's being I don't know what you get, what you did. I don't okay. know. I don't. I can't ever remember them. I think I'm right. Okay, if someone please tell us. Simply saying steak is not a No, cut. that's not my answer. I don't know about beef. Steak. Okay. I mean, that's not a cut. I know, but like... <laughs> So what I kind like of cut do you like? And you said steak. A New York steak. In New York is the cut. New York is the shape of the cut. All you said was steak. No, I said. Yes, you did. You no, did. Say that's New not York. my answer. <laughs> <laughs> Next question. Steak is not a cut. I didn't say steak was my you cut. No, I didn't. Move on. Dude, we were, okay, everyone below answer. Yes, you did. Go. New York. Stop, Chelsea. New York. Whatever. Next question. Last song you listened to. <laughs> I'm answering. I'm, I'm reading my friend's answers at the same time. Uh, the last time I listened to music, I'm, I'm in agreement with there's some crap the kids have on. <laughs> so 
Sorry, Laura, I'm reading your answers out loud. Uh, last night I had music on in the car. We took the, I took the teenagers for a drive last night to get out of the house at 10 o'clock, and I had to listen to their music. It was not bad, it just happened to be their style of music. I think the last song when I got out of the car was like Justin Bieber's, uh, that new one. It's pretty good. Uh, last book you read. Mine is right there. What is it called again? Well, yeah, the, the yellow one. The yellow one? I read Olive Kitteridge. And I need to read Olive now. Olive again is the next one after this one. I think mine was America's First Daughter. It's about Benjamin Franklin's you daughter. You read that? Yeah. It's one of our book clubs. I'm a very cultured man. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I'm a very cultured man. We're on number 35. Favorite day of the week. Uh, I didn't care. Um, I mean, I guess my favorite days are Thursdays or Fridays when you're home. Uh, so you could have cared about that, but you know. <laughs> Next question. Favorite pair of shoes. <laughs> I have many favorite pairs. Yeah. Pair. We own a shoe store in case you're new. So comfortable ones. Yes. I have, yeah. They have to be comfortable. And I like a wide toe box. Um, time you normally go to bed. These days, like three in the morning. You need to come to bed. My mind won't shut off. I'm in bed by midnight, but my mind won't shut off. Yeah, I'm like, I was in bed asleep at 11.30 last night. I'm usually like around 11, 11.30. Do you prefer, uh, when, when do we normally get up? Normally it's 7. Yeah, I'm up at 8 with the kids normally for school, but now it's like 10. <laughs> These are kind of hard because like we're in a different scenario now than we were two weeks ago. What do you prefer, sunrise or sunset? Oh, I'm a total night person. I'd like yeah. to get up and see the, the sunrise, but... Generally, I like I'm watching a, a sunset. I'm a night Like person. when we're in Hawaii, I much prefer watching the sunset yep. on a beach. Describe your kitchen plates. They're white. They're, yeah, we've got a couple of different kinds, but nothing special. White or plastic. White or plastic. <laughs> do you play cards? Yeah. Because um, the other one was, do we? what's your favorite alcoholic beverage? And we don't drink uh, alcohol. But uh, favorite cards? I don't know, I haven't played cards in a long time, but it's fun. We have card games with the kids. War is fun, but I haven't played Cards yeah, we're not time. playing like blackjack or anything, but no. it's fun. What color is your car? It changes colors, kind of a blackish blue, greenish. And mine is gray. It's new. Can you change a tire? I have changed a tire, but it has been a long time. Yeah, I can. Either on a bike or a car. Yeah. Favorite state is Hawaii. That's obvious. <laughs> not even my my current state is my favorite. You you don't want to say? Um, the one to go visit. I mean, I, we live here, so I like here, but... I mean, I like here, but my favorite... Yeah, Hawaii's good. You don't have to say mine. I can't think of another one. It's not Utah. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh my gosh, I, well, you have to be rude. <laughs> my gosh. Favorite job you've ever had? My favorite job that I've ever had was working for Fidelity. Because it really, like, emphasized a lot of my career and... I wish I had stayed with them knowing what I learned from my next job because I could have done more of my career with them had I known what I was capable of, I guess. So I really like Believe it. in yourself. No, I just didn't know what, I didn't know what jobs looked like at that point. I was fresh out of college and I didn't know what jobs looked like in the financial field aside from like banker, accountant, that kind of stuff. I didn't know what that looked like until I started working for companies and seeing what those jobs looked like. And then, yeah. Um, I guess my would be what I'm doing. I mean, I don't know. Not necessarily selling shoes, but owning your own business. Yeah. Being in charge of yourself. That's what I do. Last one, we actually made it to 50. That went quick. How did you get your biggest scar? My biggest scar is all the way down the front of my shin. It is from multiple run-ins with the gravel on the street that I grew up on. They would gravel the street up to a certain point and then end it at like the cul-de-sac. And so when we were running around playing like night games and stuff in the summertime, you'd hit that gravel section on the street when you're running in the dark, not knowing you're going to hit the gravel and you just turf it and you just scrape the whole front side of your leg. And then that was also the time when I was like a teenager learning to shave my legs for the first time. So I would scrape all those scabs and stuff with my razor, even if after it healed. That skin was like new skin, and so then it just was not a good scenario. So now I have no pigment up my whole shin. Ouch. Chain. I don't even know where a scar is. You don't have any. Do you have a scar from like your. He's drilled his finger. No, there's no scar. Your fingers heal up really nicely. From the cut I got the other day, 
It's all healed up. Yeah, I can, it just looks like, just a, a, little bit. like a hangnail or something. And then this finger, there's no, well, maybe a little dot on when I put the drill through it. Um, I don't know, there's a scar on my arm here somewhere. Oh, I have one on my elbow. I just came from basketball practice. I, this one is also from one of those falls on the concrete. Yeah, see you can't if you really can. see, it's hard to see. Uh, yeah, you can't see it with the light. I guess I'm just more coordinated. Well, on that note. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, I can't think of any scars that I have. Okay. Well, that's all 50. I'm surprised we made it through the 50. Well, Hopefully kinda... this was fun for you guys. Just Feel tell free them. to answer them yourself. Yeah, very, that'd be awesome. You to know? get to know you guys, if you want. Put them down below, whatever. That'd be cool. Uh, just something fun with everything that's going on. We're not like, you know, I don't know what other YouTube people do that try to jazz things up, but... Uh, well, and, but we're not like into challenges or we're yeah. not jazzy people, so... We're not like showing off our Tesla or, yeah. you know, I don't know, getting sponsored trips to someplace. Nobody you is can, probably now. Yeah, no one's getting Nobody's sponsorships getting sponsorships right now. go anywhere but stay home. If you want to sponsor us when this <laughs> yeah, is all over, you are more than welcome More than healthy. Yeah, we'll but be happy. Anyway, we just wanted to kind of lighten the mood and just do a little bit of just something different. And we appreciate everyone who has not only been following us for a long time, and we're literally walking through this whole journey with you guys and learning what you guys are doing at home, but also all of our new subscribers. We are, we just hit about 100 new subscribers in the last two weeks from a lot of this scenario going on and, and we've got some new commenters and everything yeah. so it's, it's fun we love your comments we try to reply to all of them oh, i replied to every one of them yeah yeah i try to as well you know if i don't i'm sorry yeah but uh yeah thanks for the comments thanks for subscribing and watching and come back for more. yeah come back for more yeah thanks guys take care bye oh enough about beef steak that's what i do i'm a very cultured man <laughs> oh my god it's okay.